How's it going everybody and welcome back to another Pokemon analysis video with the Roshank Remshin. In today's video, we're going to be taking a look at the newly revealed Pokemon Bounce Sweet. Bounce Sweet is actually a rather straightforward Pokemon in that it doesn't bring any crazy new ability to the table and its typing is rather conventional in pure grass. According to the official description of this Pokemon, Bounce Sweet emits a delicious smell from its body that makes it popular with the people of Alola. Unfortunately, it's also often swallowed whole by other Pokemon because of this scent. Its name originates from the fact that it flees from danger by bounding or skipping along. When attacked by an opponent, Bounceweed drives off the opponent by rotating the calyx on its head. Bounceweed is classified as the fruit Pokemon and is a pure grass type. It's very tiny at only 1 foot tall and 7 pounds, which makes it rather lightweight and makes me think it will have decent speed. It can have two different abilities in Leaf Guard and Oblivious, which are both abilities that we've seen before. I believe that Bounce Sweet is going to evolve two times, and it kind of reminds me of Badoo and the rest of Badoo's evolution line. But I do think that the typing for the final evolution of Bounce Sweet is going to be different from Rose Raid. What I'm thinking is that Bounce Sweet's final evolution is going to be either Pure Grass, Grass Fairy, or potentially even Grass and Water, because fruits are technically made up of mostly water. Lastly, I think Bounce Sweet's final evolution is going to have stats something like this. I've given it a decent base 80 HP, but very low physical stats of base 60. The reason why I've done this is because once again, this Pokemon does remind me a lot of Rose Raid, and also I just can't imagine a fruit Pokemon being physically strong. On the other hand, I'm expecting Bounce Sweet to have pretty good special attack and decent speed, so I've gone with a base 100 special attack and a base 90 speed. Where Bounce Sweet is really going to excel is in its special defense, and I think this is especially true if it ends up being a fairy type, because fairy types do tend to have good special defense. So I've gone with a base 120 special defense stat. Overall, if I'm being brutally honest, I think this thing will be okay in its final evolution, but nothing too crazy. But we also won't really know for certain until Pokemon Sun and Moon come out, so we'll have to wait until then to render final judgment. Alright guys, well that is pretty much going to do it for this video. As always, if you enjoyed, be sure to drop me a like down below, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already for more Pokemon Sun and Moon content in the future, and also let me know your own thoughts on Bounce Suite down below in the comments. Otherwise, I hope you all have an awesome rest of your day, and I'll see you in my next video.